Desiderius Erasmus. He was a theologian. He was born in Rotterdam or Gouda, Burgundia, Netherlands in the Holy Roman Empire on 28 October 1466. His father's name was Roger Gerard and mother's name was Margaretha Regerius. His father was a priest. His parents were not legally married. He attended school at the age of four. By nine was enrolled in the most prestigious Latin grammar school. His academic career was abruptly cut short after a plague epidemic killed both his parents in 1483. Following their death, he was put under the care of his guardians who were adamant about him becoming a monk. Impoverished state of being forced him to take up a monastery life in 1492. He became a canon regular at the canonry of Stein. By the age of 25, was ordained as the Catholic priest. He appointed as the secretary to Henry of Bergen in 1493. Bishop Henry was so impressed by his Latin skills that he rewarded Erasmus by sending him to Paris to study classical literature. In 1495, Erasmus traveled to Paris, where he was first introduced to Renaissance humanism. He studied in the College de Montaigu, a center of reforming zeal, at the University of Paris. In Paris, Erasmus engaged much of his time writing poetry, experimenting with educational writing, and moving in scholastic circles. One of his pupils, William Blount arranged a stipend for Erasmus, which allowed him to correspond with some of the most brilliant thinkers of Europe during his travels from city to city. In 1499, Blount offered Erasmus to travel to England. In England, he befriended the most skilled and proficient leaders who had a compelling influence on him. He developed an interest in religious studies and soon turned to Greek language as the key for his research. In 1503, he came up with his handbook, Encheridion Miletus Christiani. In 1506, he traveled to Italy, where he anonymously published his work, Julius Exclusis. In 1506, he graduated with a doctorate in divinity from Turin University. Temporarily, he worked as a proofreader for Aldus Manutius's publishing house in Venice. Erasmus first discovered Lorenzo Valla's New Testament notes in 1506. In 1509, he penned Morian Comium, The Praise of Folly. From 1510 to 1515, he served as Lady Margaret's Professor of Divinity at the University of Cambridge. Though not formally released from monastic vows until 1517, Erasmus mounting reputation freed him of Stein. In 1516, Erasmus came up with a heavily explained edition of the New Testament through Novum Instrumentum Omni. In 1517, he supported the foundation of the Collegium Trilling that was based on the study of three languages, Hebrew, Latin, and Greek. In 1519, he came up with a second edition of the New Testament, which was known as Novum Testamentum. The second edition was used by Martin Luther for his German translation of the Bible. The first and second edition together sold 3,300 copies. Due to his sympathetic disposition towards Protestant reforming instincts, he was accused of being a Lutheran. While at Canonry of Stein, Erasmus first fell in love with Servatius Rogerus, fellow canon. Erasmus's health gave away in 1536. Due to his failing health, he accepted an invitation by Queen Mary of Hungary, regent of Netherlands to move from Freiburg to Brabant. 
He died in Basel, Old Swiss Confederacy in the Holy Roman Empire on 12 July 1536 at the age of 69. In the kingdom of the blind, the one-eyed man is king. Said Desiderius Erasmus, 